Good evening, everyone. Along with Eddie Olchek, I'm Mike Emmerich, and an air of expectancy about this game because when you walk through the turnstiles and you go up to your seat, you know you're going to get to see the top point getter in the league, and that's a thrill. Who doesn't love to see goals and points, Doc? And when you have the leading scorer in the entire league on the ice, he's going to get a lot of attention from the other team's best defensive players. Let's look at the starting netminders. He gets the nod in goal tonight despite a loss in his last outing. Sergei Bobrovsky was undrafted, signed by the Flyers, and christened the Penguins' new arena as a rookie with a Philadelphia victory. We are about to begin, and Derek Stepan is a part of the starting lineup. Hastings, Minnesota, grew up in the rink there. His dad worked there. That's a great deal for a kid. Shoots one. Fired one and it got the post. Read that play in his own end. Laid on to step on. Gathered up again by O'Reilly. Oh my, what a hit. Oh, you gotta love that early hit, Doc. You get to the rink, you wanna set a tone for your team if you can, and an early hit is one way to do it. Skilled play by Prosser. That pass. Right in front. Oh, terrific save on a great chance. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Let's it go. Strong shooter against a strong goaltender, and the guy with a trapper won. It's a stoppage and a startage now for Ray. Hope he's play this season has been so consistent. He's got an excellent win-loss record. He doesn't give up the bad goal when it's a crippling time for a team. He makes the big save when he has to. And as a result, the penalty killing's been really good, and they have enough confidence to be aggressive offensively to put enough numbers up on the board. Thanks very much, Ray. Now it's directed to Oduya. Great cut. The net comes off. Play is stopped. This is always so frustrating. The puck's around the net. You get yourself there, now you bump into the net, and it bumps off the moorings, the play is whistled dead. Saskatoon's had the last 10 games to be admired. They've been physical, they've been aggressive, their power play has been exceptional, but they're gonna get no break tonight because their opponent has been every bit as good in those areas in their 10-game segment. Over six minutes have elapsed here in the first. Both teams are still looking for their first strike. Face off and a solid tie up and help arrive. Good job. Didn't miss by much. That's a great scoring chance, but he just missed. He'll be looking to get the next one. Got that pass in his own end. Collected by Oduya. The Rockets are driving it from the wing. Out in front. Gathered up again by Camilleri. Saskatoon's recoiling back in the defensive zone. Look out, here it comes. Oh, it's the open ice hits that hurt the most. That is a solid shoulder check there. Punched away. Nice work by Hamilton. Scooped up by Spaulding. The Ducks with possession through the neutral zone. Is able to move on in. Intercepted that one at an important place. Smart recovery by Puglia. Grabs that pass in the offensive zone. Outstanding point blank save. Equal to the challenge, nice stop. Solid defensive play. He's got the puck, but he's getting harassed here. The Rockets with a neutral zone possession along the way. And he dumps it in. Schultz wants possession out of his own end. That puck's into the bench, and we'll have another faceoff. with a center ice face-off win. Takes it in from the neutral zone. 
takes a shot. Save. And he holds on and stops playing. The man known as Bob, Sergei Bobrovsky, never drafted. He played four seasons in the Russian Hockey League before signing a free agent contract with the Philadelphia Flyers. The Ducks with a clean win on the draw. Saskatoon's lugging it in the neutral zone. Good position in the slot. Goes to the backhand. The pad came in handy that time. And decides to just hold on and get a stoppage of play. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Puck dropped in the log jam, and the winger reached in and got it. Brings it in for an attack. Brings a shot. Oh, what a stop. Now that's a timely save. A beautiful one. Saskatoon's looking to head man up the wing. Bodied off the puck. Puck covered, whistle blown. Wabrowski's going to be able to make that save all day. His positioning is perfect. It's not a difficult scoring chance. Critical win where they need it. Takes that pass from the other point man. Pass to the slot. Gets the pass through to start a play. Pressure now. Back and forth they go between the points. Shot on. May not have intended it, but it hit it. O'Reilly's tripped up. That should be a penalty. The Rockets have been handed a minor penalty for tripping. He's got great stick positioning. Stick is on the ice, but unfortunately takes the skates out from under him. Coaches have to be satisfied with the defensive work and the goaltending, but there is a challenge ahead for these offenses. Be sure to get next year's season tickets now at this year's locations and prices. Without Holtby's terrific save has kept his team in this game. Intermission is coming up. Don't miss your opportunity to pick up the best location. Second period about to begin here. Let's take a look back at the first. What stuck out for you? I'm not surprised, Doc, that we're scoreless after the first period. Both teams defending extremely well, especially inside the dots. Can the power play strike early here in this period? We're underway. Blocked away. Goes back a little further. Pass attempt to O'Reilly. To Backstrom. And he steps in. Cut that pass in his own end. They must retreat and start back again. Saskatoon's motoring on through center ice. Dogged determination there by O'Reilly. Score! A power play goal! Interesting guys after the first goal is scored. Whether the team that scored is going to continue to attack or whether they'll sit back a little bit. Saskatoon's finally got the first goal of the game.
Houston. He's won that neutral zone faceoff. By number 44, Matt Barkowski, assisted by number 90, Ryan O'Rourke. Gathered up by Prosser. Trying to go to Debrinkin. Skates it into the zone. A superb hit. A great hockey play there. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Reads the play and keeps it. Up the wing to Camilleri. Got it in his own end. Moving it to Spalling. Good intercept in his own end. Great chance here, two on one. Cuts off the passing lane in the defensive zone. Crosses that line. Wonderful save. Good defensive read with that one. Oh, what a hit. That slowed things down. This is what you call a great body check. Legal along those boards. Houston's along the wing at center ice. With a blast! Great glove save. Play continues. Barkowski's trying to get out of his own end. Takes that pass and looks on. Puts one on. Score! Off the iron and in! The goalie thought he was in good position here. It just beats him. The pass to the shot is so quick. The shot delivered so hard it hits the post and goes in. Saskatoon's built a two to nothing lead, and the sky's the limit the way they've been playing. Neutralized faceoff win. Gains the zone. Parked in the slot. No team worth its name is going to let that go. And for sure, he'll be taken to task. Well, that was not a good hit at all. Now somebody's coming to the aid of the fallen teammate. guys have been eyeing themselves up all night long. They're going to get a chance to look at each other from the penalty box for five minutes. A little over nine minutes off the clock here in the second. Two goals have been scored, both by one team. To point. Puck over the glass, and we get a stoppage of play because of that. Face-off win, and now what will they do with it? A good stick there, so no complete pass. Saskatoon setting up an offense from the wing. Stolen at center ice. Tremendous job done defensively there with a poke check. Cuts off that pass in the attacking zone. Drill. Oh, what a break. That shot hit somebody. Back on his stick. Morin's tripped and a penalty should be coming. Shot. Wonderful save. He was hovering right over it. Great opportunity. Better stop. Muzzins headed to the penalty box. A minor for tripping. Oh, this is clearly a tripping call. He made no attempt to play the puck and took the legs out from the attacking player. Anything you do once, you can do twice. Let's see if that applies to this particular power play. They've already had some success on the power play with a power play goal earlier in the game. They don't have to change much. Make sure you move the puck quickly and get traffic to the front of the net. Solid work there by Oduya. Puck is thrown to Dabrinkin. 
gains that offensive line. He cut that one off in the defensive end. The Brinkett's got to be able to complete that pass. Certainly with his team ahead, that puck has to at least go forward. Up to the point. Propelled to Camilleri. Deflected off the blocker. Cleared it out of there. Power play meter is still running. It's taken by Prosser. Pitching it to Dabrinkit. Tremendous hit. I like that he's trying to create space by throwing the body around. This is a way to change momentum in a hockey game. Directing that one to Camilleri. Steps across that line. It's out of the zone. Terrific determination by Prosser. Pitching this one to Dabrinkit. Slid to Yurko. Score! A power play goal yet again. team has the advantage with the power play and he gets himself into a scoring position to get that one past the goaltender. Well, he gets beat low on the stick side. Anytime a goaltender gets beat low these days, they're not very happy with it. Saskatoon's got a 3-0 lead. They've had the puck almost the entire time. What's going on here? And they've taken that face off between the blue lines and won it. Gathered up again by Camilleri. That was a big hit. This is a way to send a message. You're not going to go away quietly. Gives it over to the point. Chip to Barkowski. The shot blocked. On to point. On the outside, a shot. Save. The Ducks have been really solid defensively. Their goaltender has not had a very busy night at all. The shots have been few and far between, but he's been sharp when he's had to be. Puck picked off. To Camilleri, to the half wall, to the front. Heaves one, terrific save. Tries to clear. Puck controlled now by the defense. Tries in front, back to the point. Sends it back the other way. Oh, and blocked away. And the referee's whistle has stopped play. A shooter might want to check his stick if that's all that he's got in the arsenal. It's not going to score very often. They win the draw. On through the corner. Let's it go. Got in the way of that one. Well, they got to be a little tired after these first two periods of play, so they'll get a rest as we start to think ahead toward period number three. It's time to support those around us with our monthly food drop. Bring three non-perishable food items, and you can receive... Holtby's had a difficult contest, and here is an example of that. For now, he gets a rest. So do we as... 40 minutes down, at least 20 minutes to go. What are your thoughts so far? Saskatoon, it's been terrific through two periods of play. They can't sit back now, though. I'm expecting a third period push from the opposition. Third period underway. If you're just joining us, you've gotten here at the right time. This is the period of decision. But next time, beyond time. Got his pad on a changing shot. Point to point pass from the left wing. Tape to tape to center. Puck free, roadblock by Prosser. Score! That's the 200th career point for him. A lot of goalies don't catch the puck anymore. They just block it with their upper shoulder. He tries to catch this one and misses it. The Rock 
Rockets have gotten this game back to a two-goal deficit for them. There's still time here in the third. Let's see what happens next. Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. And he steps across the line. The Rockets skated up on the side. Shoots. Loud pad save. Same side to Debrinkin. Great pass ahead. Snapping a pass to Marner. Gets across, looks over his options. Defensive gem with the stick. Terrific save there. Didn't look like he had anything to shoot at, and he made it tough. Now that's a beautiful stop on a great scoring chance. Oh, how can they miss that pass? Stared him down and made the save. Nicely received at the point. That's a good pad save. And he puts the glove on it and stops playing. Hope he's made a textbook stop here. He's in good shape positionally. He makes the save and he makes it look really easy. Good offensive zone win. No! Wicked shot there, Doc. Hard work here. Takes it to the corner. Muscled long to Bartkowski. And he's tripped, and there'll be a penalty. Looking to Oduya. And now we get the stoppage of play in the penalty call. The Ducks are boxed on a tripping minor. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do was sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. Houston special teams practice is focused on the power play. Let's see if it pays off. Well, you get your power play on the ice for the first time. You can really generate some momentum, whether you score or not. Have a positive power play. He imposed his will. Passing one off now to Yurko. Using the point, he's got it. If he can find the back of the net here, he'll hit a great milestone, Doc. Pass cut, strong play. Good work in clearing it out. Now it's directed to Camilleri. Pass attempt to step on. Driving in from no man's land. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. He finally got it out of there. Trying to go to Camilleri. Laid on to step on. Flings it. At least he protected his goaltender. Moving it to O'Reilly. He got rid of it. Schultz wasn't very happy in the penalty box after that fight earlier. They were chirping back and forth for much of the five-minute major. Great job on a cut pass. That one slung back out, and so there's still some more time left on the power play. Puck is thrown to Muzzin. Houston's looking to head man up the wing. Looking from the corner. The Ducks have killed off the penalty, and so we're back at full strength. Pitching it to Muzzin. Terrific opportunity, but a missed pass, and so they have to drop back. Great shooting lane. Wonderful save. It didn't look like he had a thing to shoot at. Now oh, that's a solid save. Down to ringside we go yet again. Ray, what do you know? Bobrovsky's been magnificent tonight. Anytime the team has been under pressure, he's made the saves. Offensively, he's given his guys a little room to breathe. Can't ask for much more than what we're seeing right here. He has been spectacular in goal tonight. Absolutely, Ray. Thank you. Over eight minutes still to go in the third. So some success here. And they've cut the lead to just one. Propelled to O'Reilly. Tripped up on the play, and there will be a penalty. Lindholm's going to the box, and the call is tripping.
Oh, this is a tough call. He was trying to play the puck, but he tripped up the attacking player. The power play has been well oiled. They've connected twice already. Let's see what develops off this faceoff. The Rockets with a faceoff win. Cleared back along and out of harm's way. He steps in from the neutral zone. That one is pointed to him. Walks the blue line. Cut that pass in his own end. Well, that's a bad turnover, Doc. When you're ahead, that puck has to be moved into a safe area of the ice 100% of the time. Fires wide of the net. To Yurko. Saskatoon's moving it up the wing. Turned a shot on net. Marvelous save. A great chance was no chance. Lots of good things ahead, including a string of home games. Plenty of home cooking. Probably not from the referees, though. Quick work on the faceoff. Oh, he got that! Sent on back down by Muzzin. Saskatoon's up the wing, setting things up. Yurko's hooked on the play. There will be a penalty. The goalie gets to the bench. Still, there's time on this delayed call. The Rockets guilty of a minor penalty for using the stick blade. Just a hook. Well, what he was trying to do is try to get the puck, but unfortunately for him, he reached in and hooked around the player. Off to the penalty box he goes. It's a five on three, it's a power play, and it's a chance to do some damage. His team is ahead in this game, and he's doing a wonderful job in the faceoff circle springing. Back to the point. Stole that pass at a critical end of the ice. Terrific determination by Prosser. Pitched right ahead through center. Lid to O'Reilly. Enormous hit. He's crushed. There's a phrase in hockey, hit or be hit. That's exactly what happened. Skill play by Backstrom. Swept on to Oduya. Oh, and the pass wouldn't go. And they are in. Really good cut of the pass. Oh, what a hit that one was. Backstrom's often the focus of other teams' physical play. He's going to have to pick himself up after he got trucked there. Took it up the boards and holds. Strong wrister. Score! What a power play these guys have. Surprised at how quick that snapshot got on him. He hangs his head as he gets beaten on the glove side low here. This is a shot most goalies in this league expect to stop. Saskatoon's goal has taken them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. Took that pass perfectly off the wing. Didn't go very well there. Who comes up with it? And directed up the wing to Upshaw. Can start the attack going in the zone. Handled in the corner by Upshaw. Really good job by the defenseman there. Carries it to the corner. Nice tip of the pass. A shot. Terrific shot, but a great point blank save. The shooter shaking his head. Great save. Saskatoon's got it between the blue lines. One minute left. So we're into the last minute. All is academic here. Directing that one to Upshaw. Gets in and he'll look over his options. Got that pass in his own end. And the pass goes back over the blue line, so they have to recoil. Look out, the hits are coming. 
Well, you can almost feel the frustration bubbling over here, Doc. He just flattened this man, maybe trying to turn something around in a positive nature on a night that has been pretty brutal. Chip to Yurko. Shoots one. Well done with that pass. And ring more bells on that one. One after another. Shot. Didn't have time, but he saved it anyway. A timely save. That is tremendously tremendous. That wasn't a very dangerous opportunity at all, but to be sure, the goalie drops to the butterfly and turns it aside. Won that face off. Now what? Did what he's paid to do. And the game is over. Houston's finished the night like so many in recent memory. Another loss. So that is it for this one. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. For Eddie and Ray, Doc saying good night all.